Oh, fish on. Here we go. Look, there's a blue hill. Hit that right away. Hi, guys. This is Jurgen with another adventure. Today, we're at Isleta Lake, a private pond. It was a spur of the moment fishing trip. Um, I know I haven't made uh, videos lately. It's been a couple of weeks, but I'm here with my family. We're gonna have a good time. And uh, in the warm months, in the summer, they uh, stock catfish in here. But I really wanna catch uh, a bass. So let's see what we can catch today. So Isleta Lakes is a really great place to take your family. They have three huge ponds and their facilities are clean. Their restrooms are immaculate. So if you bring your family, it's a, it's a good place to, if, if you wanna get into fishing, it's a good place to, to bring your family, your kids to start off. So yeah, come and check it out. All right, let's go catch some fish. So we're gonna start off with our catfish bait. You guys know me, I like to use my, my mackerel as cut bait. I'm gonna cut it up in little cubes and then I'm gonna put it on the hook for some catfish. Again, we're starting off with a simple Carolina rig and I'm gonna add my cut up mackerel to this uh, to this hook here. I don't remember if it's a circle hook or a octopus hook. I think it's an octopus hook. Right, let's see how we're gonna rig this. All right, we're gonna rig it this way. Uh, mackerel has really strong skin, so the hook really doesn't come off of the, the bait. I'm hoping that my wife can catch the first fish. So, hopefully we get a hit. Put them right there. Right there. My wife's gonna be sitting right here and keeping an eye on this bowl. You guys ready to fish? Are you ready to fish? Yeah. What's that? An ant? Be careful. Alright, so this rod, we're gonna put a little piece of worm on here because there are some bluegills in here as well we'll see if Adi yell I can catch one here you go Adi come you know how to use this rod you press this and then you cast it oh Look, there's a blue hill. Hit that right away. Oh, shoot. Come here, Addy. You got blue hill right there already? Yeah. That's for. Wow. That's a nice one. It's way bigger than Let's the clean them up. Caught a beach. Got the blue hill. Jeremiah got it. Let me see. There he is. See you. Did 
There you go, Addy. Here you go. Addy, you gotta hit, you gotta hit. Pull him in, pull him in. Pull your, your, your rod up, your tip of your rod. Addy, you're catching lots of today. It's a little smaller one. Bluegill. Oh, look at mommy had a hit. Just pull it out, even if you pull it with the whole thing. Tighten your slack. Tighten your slack. There you go. And see if it hits it again. Tighten your slack like this, and you wait to see if it's going to hit it. See, look. Yeah, good job, Jeremiah. Yeah, I think it hit it and it stopped. So let's put it back down and wait, okay? So this is all you have to do. See mm -hmm. how my time, and if it pulls it, then I'll jerk it, pull that rod up to set the hook. Mm -hmm. Okay, with some power. I'm seeing if it's hitting, I'm feeling. There's nothing right now. See, once the line is tight, I can really feel it really well. Okay, we'll put them back. So it looks like we had a hit. Let's start in the slack again. It's a learning process. Okay, when you pull that rod up, don't worry about the stand, just just pull it out. Could be a small one or something can bump it. Sometimes they bump it, mm -hmm. they investigate, and they just don't really eat it yet. Let's see, okay? Oh, you got a little guy, huh? Let's see. Put him over here. Nice. Oops. Fix the camera angle. Nice. He has a lot of gold, gold in the spots. Nice picture, Jeremy Nathaniel. Fish on. Get the net. Fish on. I got a crappie. Where's that? Back? A crappie. Get it, get it, get it, get it. That's a nice crappie. Nice white crappie. Wow, he's pretty big. Grab the the Fly that red um He's big. Whoa, what's that? A crappie. That's with the uh, crankbait here. How what are you doing? 
doing? I'm gonna grab them. Here we go. Episode. Until next time.